Welcome back everybody to the Mario's Missing playthrough. Clearly the most exciting game in the entire world. I mean, my god, this this game is just full of all sorts of excitement and and crazy fun exciting moments. Yeah, it's so exciting that I'm using the word exciting in like every single sentence. Yeah, I don't know. Anyway, so we're in a <laughs> brand new city in the world. Wow, it looks very oh, how should I put this Japanese like? Huh. <laughs> I wonder if I'm onto something. Anyway, um, so yes, uh, following up from the previous video, part six, um, I, I believe I asked Dark Reinhardt, uh, what landmarks Chile would have if, if it was in this game, and he replied by telling me that one would be the National House, La Moneda, or The Money, the Entel Tower, and the statue of Pedro de Valdivia in the Weapons Plaza. Which is not a weapon full of... Which is not a plaza full of weapons. It's just called that. Yeah, he totally had to add that in too. Because, you know, I'm sure we'd all be thrown off by that name. Mm hmm yes indeed. Anyway, uh, oh wow, we're already up to our first landmark. Wow, it's the Great Buddha of Kamakura. Well, you can pay extra to visit inside the Buddha's <laughs> bullet train. Okay. <laughs> More like the Billy. And the Buddha is, uh, I don't know, a former sumo. <laughs> well, looks like I got that one wrong. But hey, you know, these are all guesses. Yes, okay, the belly. And some guy named Daibutsu lost his house because of <laughs> Proposition 13. Yes, a tidal wave actually came and hit his house. Well, that's just terrible. Uh, unfortunately, I didn't read the pamphlet on this landmark. So I have no idea who that person is. And if you do, well, good for you. And wow, we're just um, skipping a lot of time here. I mean, we're just... I just want to get this done. <laughs> I'm telling you. Um, 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 oh boy, sumo wrestling. How exciting is that? <laughs> Wrestlers wear a bun and a leotard. <laughs> yeah. Uh, what, was the, what was the other thing? The, um, the point of the sumo wrestling is to um, make your opponent wear a fancy dress or something? I don't know. And there's the... Ow, oh, I totally forgot to uh, look it up. Gosh darn it. Okay, so it was the Kokugikan Arena. Yes, there we go. We have to get everything absolutely right. Otherwise, it's simply not good enough for this playthrough. Mm-mm, certainly not. Oh, something else I forgot to mention. Thankfully, he pointed this out. Uh, a, a subscriber of mine named Wire Mario <laughs> lives in New York City. City. Yes, he also lives in New York City. Not just Ty Man and Zero B36, but a third person actually lives in New York City. Three whole people, oh my god. Yes, Wire, Wire Mario? <laughs> I love how he says that. Anyway, I completely forgot to uh, look at the questions, but does it really matter? It was something about lanterns and, yeah, lighting the way and, uh, I don't know. Fancy stuff. Wire Mario? <laughs> okay, I totally got to get that out of my system. But I think I did now, so we're good to go. Anyway, Globulator Yoshi, navigate us to the place that we're actually in right now. Well, it's not India. It's not Russia. It's not China. And it's, uh, oops, I went the wrong way. There it is. It's Tokyo, Japan. Wow, how exciting. Bew, 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 and that's it for that city. Wow, that was like record time, wasn't it? Yeah. What else can I say other than the fact that I'm running out of things to say? I mean, seriously, this just... I want to call this this game the most exciting game in the world, but I would be lying to all of my very loyal viewers. And uh, my viewers are, uh, well, they're awesome, and they don't deserve to be lied to, okay? Uh, this is a pretty big city. I wonder where we're at. There seems to be some sort of pyramids and, uh, well... Lion, lion things with the with with human heads on them. I wonder what that is. Hmm. Anyway, oh my god. Um, well, I guess. Uh, oh shoot! I thought I had um, uh, reception on this game, but apparently, well, <laughs> this wasn't really much of a game, in uh, in the context. But yes, I actually have well the trivia, um, which I, I pretty much went over already. Um, 
It said that this game is well also well known for the creation of the internet meme Ouija, which is a picture of Luigi drawn over the sprite of him from the PC version. The line, you won't find Adobe here in Nairobi, has also become an internet meme. Uh, that is it. I mean, I have absolutely nothing else. Oh, wow, there's the Great Pyra no Pyramid. Oh, my God. And, you know, I was thinking this to myself. Um, the the thing that they, they stole, the Koopas, the artifact that they stole was the top brick from the pyramid. So, that being said, they stole one brick from the pyramid, and because of that, the whole pyramids had to shut down. Uh, unbelievable. Yeah. It's so like I said before, I mean, what was it, in the first part of this playthrough, this this game, it, it just doesn't make sense half the time. Well, more like 75% of the time, if you want to get technical. Uh, okay, well, uh, yeah, severe time skip because, well, it's just me running around this place, <laughs> Egypt, and uh, <laughs> not finding any artifacts, but here, uh, in the very last place that I look, even though that's, that's sort of like... Uh, an, I don't know, not really the uh, sort of phrase that you want to use, because, of course, when you say the phrase, you know, I found this in the last place that I looked, uh, basically, I mean, that's obvious. I mean, after you find it, why are you going to keep looking for it? <laughs> yeah, um, but yeah, it was actually the last street that I actually hit. Crazy. What did the Egyptians trade for the clock tower? Recipe for french fries. Oh, <laughs> Now that's a nice picture there, the Mosque of Muhammad Ali. Very nice. And no, not the boxer. God, what's wrong with you people? Anyway, <laughs> I'm just insinuating that you that you guys just have no idea. Because I certainly didn't. And yes, now we're hitting up the Sphinx. Wow. I mean, that's gotta be, aside from the pyramid, it's, it, the Sphinx has gotta be one of the most well-known landmarks in Egypt. Well, aside from, I guess, also the Nile River. <laughs> yeah. What, how did that joke go? Um, something on the Nile? Dial on the Nile? I don't know. Oh my god, Michael Jackson. Wow, that was, like, unbelievably close. Did you see he was, like, inches away from me? Wow, that was, that was like, my life just flashed before my eyes, okay? <sighs> Awfully long road here. Bridge, whatever you want to call it. But yes, Yoshi, save us from this uh, crazy game, and, and well, let's get it done. <laughs> get her done. Well, it's not in Antarctica, obviously. Cape Town, South Africa. Nairobi, Kenya. Ethiopia, there it is. Cairo, Egypt. And we're gone. Oh, wow. I can't believe I didn't get a time bonus either. I, I was like blazing through that level. Oh, well. Anyway, that's it for this part of the playthrough. Join me in part 8, which will be, <gasps> spoiler alert, the very last part of this playthrough. Oh my god, it's over already? Well, just, um, taking this from the Game Boy Donkey Kong playthrough. Snap, slap my knee and call me a windshield. See you all next time.